Hitters everywhere in the major leagues tonight. The revenge of the Louisville Slugger, and there's no better place to start than on the banks of Lake Erie. And if this one had been a little league affair, and some say it resembled that, it would have been called right after the anthem. Funny thing about this, and there was a lot funny, you'll see, is that Boston and Oil Can Boyd got behind 1-0 after the first batter. Tony Bernazard clubbed a solo shot, and the Indians were quickly up by one. But the next time they were able to score, they were down by 20 and embarrassed badly. Red Sox made their sixth made the sixth inning their record breaker. They sent 17 batters to the plate in that inning. 11 straight reached base and 11 scored with two outs in that inning. And it was 17 to one. Amazingly, only three home runs by Boston hitters. Tony Armas with a grand slam and a two run shot and Spike Owen who was traded to Boston recently by the home run hitting Seattle Mariners where he had not hit one. Owen scored six runs and that tied an American League record. The 24 runs, the most ever given up by Cleveland. Obviously, 24 runs and 24 hits are Boston records for this season, but everything is well off the Major League marks. But try and tell that to the Cleveland fans and to the five Indians pitchers who tried in vain to get people out as Boston was able to somehow <laughs> everything fell. Look at this. Boston able to eke out just got by nipped a cliffhanger Spike Owens and the Boston Red Sox to the tune of 24 to 5 the final score 24 hits 24 runs only one error yes sir it's over 24 to